Hey, what's up, Brotherhood channel? It's your Friday guy, bleh. it's your Friday guy, Kai, and yeah, today's Sunday. Sorry about that. Um, but this week we we did a like free topic slash missed topic. So if you missed any topics this month or in the past few weeks, we could kind of um, use this week to catch up and talk about that topic. And so I missed a topic a few weeks ago about testosterone and mood changes. So that's what I was going to talk about today. So just head straight into it. Um, so with testosterone, really the, the biggest mood changes for me was it really mellowed me out. So just pr prior to starting testosterone, I had a lot of anger and a lot of, I would have these little outbursts where I just throw something and like storm out the the door kind of thing and um, when I started testosterone a lot of that actually really mellowed out and I wasn't as angry anymore um, so I know with testosterone a lot of people can say a lot of people say it could make you more angry and everyone's experiences is definitely different I can only talk for myself and my own experience but um, I would say it's not it's not it's not a guarantee that's gonna make you angry because for me I didn't have that effect it really did the opposite I became a lot less angry and I had a lot more control over my emotions than I did before starting testosterone like I said everyone's different and everyone's gonna have different experiences and your experience could be completely different from mine but that's kind of how I experienced testosterone with my mood now one thing I will say is um, during my first few months of testosterone, I was on a very low dose, uh, 0.2, and I don't know if it is a if it was a mental thing or an actual physical thing, but I would notice because I was doing 0.2 every other week, so I'd go two weeks without a shot, and I don't know if it was a mental thing or if it was really happening, but I'd notice when I'd get near the end of those two weeks close to time for my next shot, I'd experience a lot of anxiety, a lot of um, just trouble managing my anxiety. I remember I was at like a house party for New Year's with my, um, with like my sister, and um, we weren't supposed to spend the night but then they decided they wanted to spend the night at the house and I just kind of like had a breakdown and this is when I was on testosterone and I was just like I want to I want to go home I want to be at my house kind of thing and I ended up having um, my like like some other family take me home while my sister and and all of them stayed at the house but like things like that and it was like kind of near the end of my two weeks and I don't know if that was related or not but I did notice that that I had some trouble with anxiety and stuff during those first few months when my dose was really low and kind of like I'd go two weeks without doing another dose so yeah there's that and then the last thing I'll just say it's not really as much of a mood thing because my my sadness when I get sad stays the same but kind of the ways I express it is what has changed on testosterone because with testosterone it definitely became a lot harder to cry and um, that's not to say I wouldn't be upset because I definitely would and I'd be at the same level as where I used to cry when I wasn't on testosterone but uh, I noticed that I wouldn't cry as easily I wouldn't cry as quick as I would before I was on testosterone and um, I noticed that a lot more when I first started testosterone and as I guess my body kind of got used to testosterone and stuff as things went on I it did get kind of um, like I wouldn't cry at all at the beginning and then as I got further on testosterone I actually did kind of regain my ability to cry and stuff um, when you know when things were kind of bad enough and and um, now I've actually been off testosterone for a little over a month, maybe getting close to two months. I don't remember exactly when I stopped. Um, but but yeah, I 
am crying a lot easier again, and I've noticed that for sure. I even cry when things aren't sad, like happy things. Like I'll watch a movie, uh, and I'll start crying because the movie's over, and I'm like, that was such a beautiful movie type thing, and it's kind of, it's it's interesting, and and that definitely did happen when I was on testosterone too, like, as I got further on testosterone, I'd still get kind of, like, I realized I was getting emotional again, like, things were coming back, my ability to be emotional was kind of coming back, uh, as I hit, like, four years on testosterone and stuff like that, but now I'm just, like, yeah, I'm not on testosterone, and I'm, like, yeah, I, I could cry pretty easily now, and it's kind of, like, wow, so, I mean, as far as, mood changes go I know that wasn't really exactly a mood change that was more of a uh, expression mood expression change but yeah as far as like being more angry and stuff I didn't experience that personally I experienced kind of the opposite um and now being off testosterone I'm still kind of uh I have really good coping mechanisms for when I feel upset and stuff a lot of work with psychologists and stuff like that so that's helped a ton and I'm doing much better so it's it's not too bad now but I think a lot of things were playing a role before um just my lack of coping skills the test the dysphoria the not having um, testosterone a whole bunch of things so yeah that's that's about that um I will see you all next week as always, stay strong, stay safe, and stay you. I love you all. I'll talk to you soon. Peace.